Welcome to episode 2 of our 2024 Bali holiday. So what did this cost? Well our return airfare was $1100 and the hotels, shopping, tours, food and visas and all the other incidental expenses for the 11 day trip per person came to $900. So the total cost of the holiday was $2000 NZ. Our adventure holidays don't start when we get to destination, they start when we leave home. So follow our story as we head to Bali. New Zealanders have to get a visa for Bali and this is done online in about 10 minutes and costs $55.75. At this time we also had to pay for a Bali tax and that was $15 and that's done online too. It was a 2 a.m. start as we headed to Auckland Airport for our 6.30 a.m. Jetstar flight. It was a McDonald's breakfast. So we've got a, a cheeseburger, three dollar seven dollar for two, and a senior's coffee for three dollar. Budget holiday. Great way to start a budget holiday. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> As budget travellers, we bought our own sandwiches on the excellent Auckland to Sydney flight and Airbus A320-200 series. At Sydney Airport, I invited Chris to come to the toilet with me, but he didn't seem to like that idea. We took the free bus to the Sydney Domestic Terminal and dropped off our bags at a cost of $15 Australian, then took the Uber to Chinatown, about 20 minutes ride. In Chinatown we called into Paddy's Market for some window shopping. The market has a nice fruit and vegetable section. Hey uh, Bev you look really guilty. <laughs> what have you been doing? Nothing. Nothing. No. No, nothing. Dodgy, dodgy. <laughs> Helping themselves with some fruit. Along from the fruit market is the fish market. Upstairs from the market is a shopping mall and food court. Well this is how our holiday to Bali starts in Sydney. <laughs> Eating Chinese cakes. There you go. Chinese New Year, Year of the Dragon. For that reason, Yamcha queues were through the roof. We reminisced at a restaurant we went to last year. And finally, we went to the mall's Games Arcade. Outside in Dixon Street, Teresa shopped for her favourite cosmetics and then we took the tram down to Darling Harbour. Have you been here before? Have you been here before? 
Smile, you're on candid camera. It was really hot, so we pulled over at the pontoon bar in Darling Harbour for some refreshments. You must have been. You must be the. You must be the first white person that I've seen that uses uh, chopsticks using straws. <laughs> well, look at that. <laughs> at Sydney Domestic Airport, we had a light snack, and then. Unbelievable! I dropped my boarding pass. Chris, 50 meters behind me, found it on the floor. Our flight to Melbourne was one and a half hours. A great flight, and when we got off it was fairly cold. We took an Uber to the Melbourne Airport Hotel, which was only about three kilometres away. Okay, the uh, Melbourne Airport Hotel. Looks very comfortable. How do you like, what do you think of the motel, Chris? Fantastic. Oh, bad luck, I'll have to bunk in with Theresa here. Shower. Kitchen. Balcony outside. <laughs> the next morning we were up at 3.30 a.m. to catch our flight from Melbourne to Bali. The, the previous day we were up at um, 2 a.m. was it or something? I was up earlier than that. Yeah? One. And the next day we are up at yeah. 3 a.m. Yeah. What, a, what a wonderful life yes. we're having. Fantastic. It should, <laughs> it should um, stunt my growth. Yeah, that's right. That's, that's why I've got no hair. I might become old. <laughs> yeah, better get old. One o'clock. That's all right. Yeah, in a glass. yeah. it could be worse, uh, Chris. You could be Asian, like me. It could be worse. I could still be at Sydney. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you could still be in New Zealand. In fact, I might still be in. Melbourne. In Melbourne, Melbourne. yeah, that's right. <laughs> I'm living in the... Um, uh, at the airport, 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 yeah, with a blow-up bed like we saw in Auckland. Next, we took an Uber to Melbourne Airport. Okay, Chris, you, Chris, you're smiling. You're smiling. I am smiling. <laughs> <laughs> My car flutters have gone. Yeah. So, <laughs> All right. On way. You're on your way. Yeah. On your bike. Bit of advice, check your spelling. Mm. Over and over and over and over again. Yep. Uh, are you enjoying our Bali holiday so far, wonderful, Chris? Wonderful, wonderful. Yeah. Like the long sleeps. Right, right. Especially the five yeah. hour one. The only problem is, of course, we haven't got to Bali yet. No. <laughs> Getting up at three is a little bit of That's right. I feel like we've been on, on holiday for about two weeks now. That's right. <laughs> but we've only got to Melbourne. Yeah. I enjoyed this journey. You enjoyed it? <laughs> what a great start to our Bali holiday. Everyone is all smiles and anticipating the good times ahead. So stay tuned for our next episode as we arrive at Destination Bali. <laughs>